Lights are a fashion staple when it comes to rodeo season, but for first-time buyers, knowing what to get and where to start can be overwhelming. No worries, our friends at Cavenders are here to give you a crash course on buying your first pair of boots. Basically what I try to do is tell people not to get so caught up in all everything, the, you know, the whole works of the boot. There's a few tips that I tell people to, to make sure that they do, is to make sure that the, uh, the boot is comfortable, it'll be snug, but yet not overbearing to where it actually is painful and you lose the sensation in, you know, in your foot. Because if they're uncomfortable, you're never going to wear them. And so they won't ever break in properly. You know, so we want to make sure that we fit you properly. They fit properly when you leave the store. And also understand that it is an investment, but we don't want you buying boots every month because they're un uncomfortable for you. you know, your average price point is probably about, uh, I would say 180 to about 250. We'll get you a good, decent boot that'll last you a while. Some of them, they have different styles of heels. You've got your flat heel, some uh, as well as your, your, the higher top heel that have it put you more on the ball of your feet, kind of resembling something like you were sitting like on a, with a, uh, with a high heel shoe, but yet a little bit more stylish. They have, of course, for your dancing, they've got the leather bottoms, okay? And all your designs. Now that's one thing that people kind of concentrate more on, especially with the ladies' boots. All the little, the catch me, the catch me things there. Now this, this is one of my favorite boots for the ladies. Um, it's really stylish, but it's not way out there. It's got some turquoise back inlay, also with some nice stitching, and also cut in the top. Now this, ladies, will actually help you, it, the deeper the cut in the front, the actually the more relaxed it'll be around your leg. And also they have different styles of toes. So you've got your snip toe, of course with your leather bottom and your higher heel. So it's better for dancing, or just strutting your stuff, one of the two. Then you have, you're a little bit more square toe and also a flat heel. And then you have different colors, combinations. Um, it's, all, it's all preference after that, what you prefer to have. If you want to be flashy, we got flashy. If you want to be toned down, we got the, your regular old ropers as well. Um, but also too, we have great styles available. You don't know how they're going to fit until you try them on. Every foot has a boot. They make a boot out of anything. And also too, you can never have just one pair of boots. 